<coughs> really small magnet signal. Even uh, here, you go uh, uh, superconducting uh, on the uh, device. You can detect very really small magnet signal like a uh, I listened to the previous uh, keynote by Professor Wang and uh, Yang. It was really interesting. I just wanted to let you know that I was at IBM Research. Also, but I joined a few years after that Nobel Prize. I joined in 1990. Uh, 
quality is uneven. So, uh, but uh, it is an easy to read and help memorize. And the next point, in, in addition to the product above, there are some home appliances uh, also have high risk and high complexity. There are microwave ovens, air high fires, and regular cleaners. And it is worth noting that nine out of 12 participants uh, would not pay attention to the danger-related precautions because they think it is too boring. And the final result, users generally believe that uh, virtual reality experience can improve the learning effect and achieve the purpose of uh, immersive, uh, immersive product experience and display. Uh, such like uh, VR can let users remote experience anytime and anywhere. Uh, even it can set, set to try out new features. And Next, we go on to the next part the discussion. Uh, I think imitate the easy to learn method from the home appliances experience is the best way to improve the learning effect. Uh, such like we can capture the advantage of product manuals like uh, information provided by officials very credible. And, and also uh, capture the advantage of teaching videos like keep the virtual feature and make the experience more vivid. And the next point, uh, remind us about the danger must be sure to the point or playful to grab the user's attention. So based on the information of the literature review and our result, results of interview, we propose the following and design direction for VR on the appliances experience. The first one is a visual 3D product function teaching. And number two is block-based product teaching step. It is formulated for user of different levels. And number three is proactively provide precaution and power knowledge. Because most of people will not pay attention to the danger information. And number five is and number four is display errors instead of error reminder. Uh, it is because if, too, if there are too many error reminders, will make users feel frustrated. And number five is repeat viewing deepen the impression. And number six is provide the option of enabling of audio commentary. Uh, maybe some users like to hear the sound and some don't. Uh, and next is number seven, integrate actual cases into virtual teaching. After user experience VR, it can be ensured that the, there will be no problems to do the testing in the natural environment. And the final point is incorporate entertainment elements. It is to arouse the user's interest. Okay, uh, that's all for my presentation. I really like the uh, application. So, what was what, how was the experience of the user for transforming into the uh, the advanced the AI in build or virtual home appliances. How about the experience of the equation modeling because it's more robust, it's better. Yeah, actually. So, so my my um, let's say just observation, uh, it could be that the clusterization using uh, unsupervised uh, learning, artificial intelligence, uh -huh. makes much more exact, much more precise mm -hmm. classification of the of different data. Mm -hmm. And you can use, for example, DB scan algorithm, or you can mm -hmm. use optics algorithm.
一次比。一样。